Once upon a time in a bustling, middle-class neighborhood, there lived a young boy named John. John's family was neither rich nor influential, but what they lacked in material wealth, they compensated for with strong values and an unshakable belief in the power of dreams. From a very early age, John harbored big dreams. He would often sit under the Bodhi tree in the nearby park, pondering the wisdom of Zen Buddhism. The teachings of mindfulness and the pursuit of enlightenment inspired him greatly. He believed that if he could apply these principles to his life, he could achieve greatness, regardless of his humble beginnings. John's journey, however, was not going to be easy. His family struggled financially, and making ends meet was a daily challenge. Yet, Aiden remained resolute. He understood that the path to success was often paved with adversity. He decided to tackle his problems head-on, much like the warrior monks he had read about in Zen literature. His first obstacle was the burden of family expectations. His parents, while supportive, wanted him to follow a traditional career path. They worried that John's dreams might lead to uncertainty. But John, driven by his vision, decided to strike a balance. He pursued his education diligently, excelling in his studies, while also exploring his passions in art and philosophy on the side. As he reached his teenage years, John encountered resistance not only at home but also from skeptical relatives and a judgmental society. They couldn't understand why he chose such an unconventional path. Nevertheless, he kept reminding himself of the Zen concept of detachment, learning to let go of external opinions and focus on his inner journey. John's financial struggles continued to loom over him. He worked part-time jobs after school to contribute to his family's income. Every penny he earned was a step closer to realizing his dreams. These hardships, he believed, were part of his spiritual journey, teaching him patience and perseverance. Years passed, and John finally found a mentor who shared his passion for Zen philosophy. This mentor, an accomplished Buddhist scholar, recognized John's dedication and decided to support him in his pursuit of wisdom. With this newfound guidance, John delved deeper into Zen teachings and honed his skills in various arts. Rejection became a constant companion on John's path. He faced countless setbacks, from college admissions to job applications. Each rejection only strengthened his resolve. He understood that rejection was merely a test of his determination, much like the koans posed by Zen masters. As time went on, John's dedication and hard work began to pay off. His art and philosophical writings gained recognition in small circles. He started giving talks on Zen Buddhism and found a small but loyal follower. Slowly, the pieces of his dream began falling into place. One day, a renowned Zen monastery invited John's to share his insights with their community. This was a turning point in his journey. His words resonated with the monks and novices, who saw in him the embodiment of Zen principles put into practice. John's success was not an overnight achievement but a result of years of unwavering determination, steadfast belief in his dreams, and a deep connection to Zen Buddhism. He had turned his life into a masterpiece, a work of art that reflected the essence of mindfulness, hard work, and the unyielding pursuit of one's true calling. In the end, John realized that success, as defined by society, was not his ultimate goal. He had found his enlightenment, not on a mountaintop, but within himself, by following the path of Zen. And in doing so, he became an inspiration to many, proving that dreams, when pursued with dedication and a Zen-like focus, could indeed become a reality. <laughs>